Understanding when and why to hard reset your Skystream puck is essential for maintaining optimal performance and resolving common issues. A hard reset, also known as a factory reset, is different from a simple restart. While restarting just turns your device off and on, a hard reset completely returns the device to its original factory settings. The key difference is that a restart is a quick fix that simply powers the device off and on, while a hard reset is a complete restoration to factory settings. You should consider a hard reset when your Skystream puck is consistently crashing, showing black screens, becoming unresponsive, or experiencing other persistent malfunctions that a simple restart cannot fix. Sky acknowledges that these issues can occur with stream pucks. While they sometimes attribute problems to broadband connectivity, the device itself can often be the source of the problem. Here's important news as of June 2025, a factory reset won't wipe your playlist or personal settings. These are stored on Sky's servers, not on your device, so they'll be automatically restored after the reset. Remember, a hard reset is part of systematic troubleshooting. It's the step to take when simpler solutions haven't resolved your Skystream Puck's performance issues. Here's the complete step-by-step -step process to hard reset your Skystream Puck. Follow these steps carefully to resolve most common issues. Step one, turn your Skystream Puck upside down to access the standby button on the bottom. Then unplug the power cable from the mains power socket. Step two, plug the power cable back in then immediately press and hold the standby button on the bottom of the puck. This button is crucial for initiating the reset process. During the reset process, watch for the LED lights to change colors in a specific sequence. This indicates the reset is working properly. Step three. Once you see the white light, release the standby button. The Skystream puck will now complete its recovery process, which can take up to 15 minutes depending on your broadband speed. If the main reset process doesn't work, try this alternative method. First, reset your Sky Remote by pressing buttons four and six together for three seconds. If you encounter no power issues, check these troubleshooting steps. Verify the power light is showing, try a different power socket, or test with a working power cable from another puck. Important warning, Sky recommends contacting their support before performing a factory reset. Doing this without guidance might lead to activation issues that could prevent your device from working properly. 